Dominic Sky? Again, doxed? I don't believe that. When someone says they're being doxed and they've also said they don't know what doxing is, they're normally stupid. Roll it! Hello and welcome back to Come Geeksum. If you are new to the channel, please like and subscribe for future content. Dominique Sky and Doxing. So what's happened is, uh, this is coming from Ghost Shells then, so big shout out to them. So, at Dominique Sky doxed people with her friends in her secret Facebook group. She locked her account due to fears of getting suspended after getting exposed, and now she comes back claiming she got doxxed by I Stand With Vic. These professional victims seek out the attention, drama, and sympathy. So what this is, this is actually coming from a few uh, things that uh, Dominique Sky has posted onto her own Twitter account. As you can see, there's a few there. Even Ron Toy gets involved. So what it is... Dominique Sky, just an update, not only was I doxxed for supporting victims of sexual harassment, assault, but they included photos of my child because who cares about targeting children too? Why not? And at Vic supporters are justifying this. This is why victims remain silent. So she put that one out, but then you had Mr. Ron Toy jump in. Sorry, it sucks that kids again brought into this. Sad face. So Revoke went back to Ron Toy with, Yep, it definitely sucks that Jamie Marshy is hoping that some kid has been molested just to make her own case stronger. So, yeah, and obviously down below then is the actual conversation we put in a previous video regarding that, because uh, Jamie Marshy, is, she has said that nothing can be done and she hopes someone comes forward which just by saying that that is actually really really bad and it's a bit like come on what the hell are you doing why would you even say that why do you hope that someone's been molested just so your case will look stronger that's just sick jamie that's sick so the other screenshots obviously they're regarding dominique sky and obviously this is another one we've done in a previous video as well this is Dominique Sky and a little uh, little conversation she was having with someone called Jessica Guida and Sarah Jean Mapes on uh, Facebook. So Jessica Guida, Guida sorry, said, this is her Instagram. She got a lot of my friends following her. Jessica Guida, wait, is it? Is she really a cop? Hmm, I wonder if they're aware of her cyberbullying bullshit. And a teacher too, nice. And we haven't actually got, got the screenshot here, but the other photo actually shows them that they, when they're talking to each other and everything else, and they're saying, oh, we, you know, I've got my friends following her now, and they're going to report anything she does, and I've also got her Twitter and other address details. That's doxing. She says she wasn't doxing, and she claims that she's been doxed herself. If you don't know what doxing is, uh, Dominique Sky, how can you claim that someone's uh, doxed you if you do not know what it means? Hmm? Food for thought there. So sticking on the actual I, K I stand with Vic and uh, kick Vic uh, situation, we got Renfamous. She has actually come back with someone. You know, I, I haven't actually got a full conversation here. These were sent to me by Mr. Gray, so big shout out to him. And it says... I don't have to be a trained chef to know the guy proudly serving a deep fried shoe doesn't know what he's doing in the kitchen. Okay. And Robert Hubbard went back with, Following your logic, however, clearly shows that you are implying that one without credentials, or credibility even, has more knowledge experience than the professional in that field. And that's quite sad and delusional, I believe, and hypocritical. So, with all of this, with what's going on, it does make you wonder what goes through the minds of the people on the kickvick side it to me i just don't understand 
where their logic is coming from. But as we were saying yesterday with Ron uh, Toy, he's he says things, he tweets them, and then either a couple of tweets later or whatever, he comes back with something which is completely hypocritical of it, of what he said in the other uh, message, and he goes against it straight away. It's <laughs> it's laughable for one, and the way he's done it. Like I said yes as well, he is either completely insane or he's just someone who's messing around and trying to get a rise out of people. But I personally do believe that he may actually be a bit uh, nuts and a bit and a sandwich short of a picnic upstairs. Just the way he comes about with things, it's just so funny. If you are new to the channel, please like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell for future updates and we'll see you soon.